What up guys, my name is Koi. Today I'm gonna to be talking about Ace Ventura when nature call. This is part two or not part two or the second movie of the Ace Ventura movies. I don't know what you would call part two movie, biology or not, bi biology? I don't know, but whatever. So let's talk about the pros. I love Jim Carrey as an actor. He did a really good job with this character. He gave it a, uh, uh, this character is such a three dimension that you could tell that he's human. He's a little crazy, not crazy, but he's a little, he's different. He's a little different than your normal person. He thinks differently. He does, he see things differently. He talk differently. He, he walk different. He's just a totally different person than your normal person. I like that. That's just give this movie such a uniqueness to it. He's just a different person. Uh, it's not even Jim Carrey. It's, he is that character. He is H. Ventura. He is that that character, that mode. I just love that. I like the... There's so much to talk about this movie. I'm gonna, I have to make it short. I love the I love the, the scene, the comedy in it, the, the way they talk, the way Ace Ventura doesn't like guano, he doesn't like bad in the way he goes about it. it everything is just so funny. Everything is so wild. <laughs> like the title, When Nature Call. It's just, when Nature Call is wild, it's, it's just strange. It just doesn't quite make sense at some time, but it is funny, you know. That's what I love about this movie. It's just funny. It's, and they know that it's poking us the fun of itself, but the character go out and he does talk uh, out of, you know, almost to the camera or almost to himself or to to the world. And I like that. It's just he's such a good character. He remind me of Deadpool. Not to that level of Deadpool, but you, he had that insaneness to it, insanity to him. And I like that a lot. The story is, is good. You, you, it's simple, but you understand the situation. You know what's going on, but you mainly focusing on Ace and his journey and how he figure out more like solving the solving a crime. And I like that. He's not a pet detective. He's more like a crime detective. So. What with the con of this movie? It's just there isn't much con I can think of right now. I think there's some scene or not unnecessarily, but that just mean be nitpicky. I like all the scene. It's just they're all good. They all kind of give to Ace a character. They really give. They really uh, tell you who he is uh, uh, when he in that environment or in that in the world. The only thing that I wish it was a little bit, uh, not shorter, it's just a little, excuse me, a little bit shorter. That is all. Overall, this movie is really, really good. It's just a classic, it's funny, it's entertaining, it's really a roller coaster ride, and it just takes you for a good ride. And I like that about this movie. So, I'm gonna end it short here, guys. Uh, what did I. What was the rating I give this movie? I give it an 8 out of 10. I really enjoyed this movie. I love the characters and, and I love the, the the acting. I love the hilarity of the movie, the way the character interact with, with the animals and with in, in the character and other characters in the stories and the way he goes about it. It's just really it's funny, you know, you it's entertaining, you know. And he comes out at the end too, and you really want that for a guy like him so 8 out of 10 guys please like thumbs up share subscribe and browse on my youtube channel i have a lot of content for you guys to check out please do so and take care bye bye